Let's make tamarind sauce to have with vegetable tempura. We need concentrated tamarind paste. Uh, if it is too thick, uh, dilute it with water. This is palm sugar syrup. I use two tablespoons here. You can substitute with brown sugar if you don't have it. Do not skip this part. Ginger and garlic are main ingredients. I use about a five cloves of garlic and a piece of ginger and coriander stem just to enhance the flavor. In my country, Myanmar, every household make this sauce uh, to have with a variety of dishes. There is no exact recipe and no one measures when they are making it. There are many different ways to do it. Basically, it just comes down to a matter of the taste. This is the final touch. A pinch of salt and roasted chili flake. Of course, it won't complete the dish without fish sauce. I just added 3 teaspoons of fish sauce. Now you can taste it and amend it as you like. I made tempura butter with self raisin flour and corn flour. The ratio is 3 is to 1 and just add a pinch of salt. Gradually add ice water into the mixture and then you get the smooth texture. Ice water control the gluten because the more gluten contain the less crispier. You can use any vegetable to fry. Now I'm using the Asian vegetable, it's called duri. It's really soft inside and crunchy outside when you find it. Be generous with the oil when you cut the tempura. After that, you can reuse a few times. Just make sure your wok is as hot as possible at the beginning and then maintain the heat so you will get all crispy and crunchiness. Look who is enjoying the food that I had to prepare. Enjoy! <laughs>